Hey, Cameron Martell of watches you can afford, and thanks to having a great relationship with some people at Certified Watch Store, I have on my wrist the Frederic Constant Classics Business Timer Moonface. The second Frederic Constant that I've had the opportunity to review hands-on, and the first with an actual moon phase complication. Now this quartz timepiece has the FC270 quartz movement in it, and for reasons that I'm going to get into in a moment, I think that this is the perfect movement for a moon phase in this price point. So second experience hands-on with Frederic Constant. Was it as good as the first, the Slimlines Classics that I reviewed back in December? Well, let's find out. Frederic Constant does affordable luxury well, as demonstrated here with the business timer. The gold plating on the case appears even and of a good quality. It's held up really well to a week's worth of wear with no visible scratches in the gold that I can see. Sapphire is the material of choice for the convex crystal and beneath it is a dial that just oozes polish. The applied indices, gold plated, are free of any defects that I could see under my macro lens and the dial itself is wonderfully textured. The polish found on the dial is also found on the outside. The case itself, awesome. Look at how it reflects and plays with light. It's a real treat to photograph and wear in any situation. The crown, engraved, is given the same attention to detail as the dial is. The engraving itself is even and uniform, and with clean lines and an even depth. If there are irregularities here, you'd never see it with your naked eye, but that it's perfect is impressive and speaks to the quality Frederic Constant brings to the watch. By comparison, the case back feels like a bit of an afterthought. The engraved logo and lettering are finely finished, but are otherwise unremarkable. However, the croc grain leather, complete with a gold-plated buckle, rounds out the package and participates in the overall feeling of luxury. Both are soft and luxurious to wear and feel of high quality, they certainly make up for the case back. Normally when I review a luxury watch, I prefer a mechanical movement. But in this case, the quartz is a sensible choice. It makes sense for the price point, and considering that the business timer tracks the day, date, week, and moon phase, it makes sense from an accuracy perspective. Most people don't leave their automatics on winders, I know I don't, rendering these functions forever incorrect without being set every time you wanna wear the watch. I think a quartz makes sense for most people here. As much of a treat the business timer is to look at, it is equally so to wear. Lightweight thanks to the quartz movement and size appropriate of 40 millimeters. The weak counter hand, the one with the red tip, moves counterclockwise. Also note the lack of a second hand. If accuracy is your priority, the business timer may not be for you. In my opinion, the lack of a second hand leaves the already complicated dial better off. The twin pushers above and below the crown operate the calendar week and date display functions respectively. Use a non-metallic or non-abrasive or pointed uh, item to operate them if you want to preserve the gold plating. To change the day subdial, you must repeatedly rotate the time between 10 p.m. and 2 a.m. as the day display cannot be changed via the crown or pushers. As of today, the Classics Business Timer is available in the gray market for around $470 to $600 and direct from Frederic Constant for around $1,000. On the lower end of that range, I think it's good value. The quartz movement is a sensible choice for a watch that tracks a triple calendar and moon phase, and it is a treat to look at and wear. On the upper end of that range, I think there's still value there, but you're going to want to look at your mechanical options from other Swiss brands because there's a few of them. In any case, if you find yourself in possession of the business timer, I'm sure you'll agree with me in that it is an excellent watch. It's a great dress watch, and if I was looking for a nice dress watch to wear on the daily, it would be a serious contender. So, thank you very much to Certified Watch Store for providing this watch for my review, and as always, check out the full review and high-resolution photos on watchesyoucanafford.com.